Hey guys, how you doing? This is Manga Etc. And I'm here today to bring a review for Sakamoto today's Manga Chapter 60. So Mr. Cameraman, I know his name was said to us within the last chapter, but I can't remember it. So for now, I'm going to call him Mr. Cameraman. Mr. Movie, actually. Mr. Movies, that's what I'm going to call him. Until further notice. But he's a madman. He's doing crazy stuff. He's all over the place. He's running wild. He's doing crazy stuff. He's, he's, he's a bit of a madman. And I'm interested to see how things are gonna roll out but before all of that madness before he started being a madman we had shin and ooh, what's his name the 14 year old boy they basically run into him and there was a humor side to how the 14 boy was reacting to him you know like you know what's so great about movies kind of thing uh you can't fast forward them you know very light humor uh i i got it but it wasn't laugh out loud funny and then we had, it wasn't a fight, we had potential for a fight where Mr. Movies, he went on the attack and we see that, okay, we don't see it, we are basically told via Shin that his abilities won't be enough to help him if they were to fight and Fair enough, fair enough. I can I, I can accept that. You know, there's always gonna be villains that work around his Billy. But what? And I hope mm, I hope it was a slight translation error because I, I didn't like what was said about how. Let me find the page because it's basically it was basically making it sound like Mr. Movies could change the future, and I didn't like that. When it comes to Shin's abilities, just make it a speed thing. Make it a speed thing. Make it that the enemy he's facing is too fast for him to perceive their movements fast enough to react to them. He might be able to perceive them, but he's because um he's perceiving them too slowly, he can't react or because his body similar to like the the Sasuke versus Rockley scenario in part one Sasuke could perceive Rockley's move but because his body was too slow there was nothing he could do about it this is what you need to be doing on Shin at all times clearly at all times but what this chapter made it seem like is that Mr. Movies could change the future so we don't get a fight like I said and that's when Sakamoto has become present along with his little friend and now I was wondering, I'm not 100% sure, but Mr. Movies, he might be a bit too, a bit, a bit too much for Sakamoto, because there's moments where Mr. Movies, he speed blitz, like for example, Mr. Movies, he speed blitz his past, ends up behind the little girl, and if you look at Mr. Sakamoto's expression, it doesn't seem like he knew that he was coming. And then when Mr. Sakamoto goes on the attack, he doesn't land a hit. So it is possible that at least for fat Sakamoto, Mr. Movies is like on top, on top of the better of the two. At least that's what I'm thinking for now, because that's what the chapter that's what the chapter is telling me anyway, basically. But like I said, Mr. Movies is a madman. He goes on a mad he goes on a mad rampage. Not rampage, sorry, I shouldn't say rampage, but he does crazy stuff. And he blo first he kills a pilot. He's like, no, 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 that's not good enough for my movie. Then he blows a hole in the plane. So right now, the remaining students. So that's another thing as well. It was mentioned like mid chapter, I think maybe. That how for a first round it's unnatural for the numbers to drop so low, regardless of who's left in the competition. So that's that. But regardless of that, Mr. Movies has now created a bigger scenario. How does one survive uh I don't know how plane how high planes go up. <laughs> I'm gonna throw a number out there, but I'm not gonna do that. But basically, they're all now dropping. Maybe towards the ocean, whatever, that's fine. But from that high, that will kill you instantly. So I'm wondering to myself, how 
are they going to survive? That's going to be interesting to see. Because I don't think there's any parachutes about. But we will see how things roll out within the next chapter. I think this chapter is a standard chapter of Sakamoto Days. So I'll give it a three star rating. Like course, guys, I'm asking for your thoughts and opinions. If you haven't already, please subscribe to my YouTube channel. But most importantly, take care. Have a nice day.